Manipuri dance, also known as Jagoi, is one of the major Indian classical dance forms, named after the region of its origin, Manipur, a state in northeastern India bordering with Myanmar Burma, Assam, Nagaland and Mizoram. It is particularly known for its Hindu Vaishnavism themes, and exquisite performances of love-inspired dance drama of Radha Krishna called Raslila. However, the dance is also performed to themes related to Shaivism, Shaktism, and regional deities such as Umang Lai during Lai Haraoba. The roots of Manipuri dance, as with all classical Indian dances, is the ancient Hindu Sanskrit text Natya Shastra, with influences and the culture fusion between various local folk dance forms. According to the traditional legend, the indigenous people of the Manipur Valley were the dance experts revered as Gandharvas in the Hindu epics Ramayana and Mahabharata, suggesting a dance tradition has existed in Manipur since antiquity. With evidence of Vishnu temples in the medieval era, the dance arts have been passed down verbally from generation to generation as an oral tradition. The first reliably dated written texts describing the art of Manipuri dance are from the early 18th century. The Manipuri dance is a team performance, with its own unique costumes, aesthetics, conventions, and repertoire. The Manipuri dance drama is, for most part, marked by a performance that is graceful, fluid, sinuous with greater emphasis on hand and upper body gestures. It is accompanied with devotional music created with many instruments, with the beat set by cymbals or manjira and double-headed drum pung or Manipuri Mr Danga of Sankirtan. Manipuri dance is a religious art and its aim is the expression of spiritual values. Aspects of this performance art is celebrated during Hindu festivals and major rites of passage such as weddings among the Manipuri people, particularly in the ethnic majority of Maiti'i people. The dance drama choreography shares the plays and stories of Vaishnavite Padavalis, that also inspired the major Gaudiya Vaishnava related performance arts found in Assam and West Bengal. History According to tradition of the Manipuri people in the Himalayan foothills and valleys connecting India to Burma, they are the Gandharvas, celestial musicians and dancers in the Vedic texts, and historic texts of Manipuri people calls the region as Gandharva Desa. The Vedic Usha, the goddess of the dawn, is a cultural motif for Manipuri women, and in the Indian tradition, it was Usha who created and taught the art of feminine dance to girls. This oral tradition of women's dance is celebrated as Chinkaral in the Manipuri tradition. The ancient Sanskrit texts, such as the Mahabharata epic, mentions Manipur, where Arjuna meets and falls in love with Chitragata. Dance is called Jagoi in a major Maiti'i language of the region and it traces a long tradition in Manipur. Lai Haraoba dance likely has ancient roots and shares many similarities with dance postures of Nataraja and his legendary disciple called Tandu. Locally called Tanku. Similarly, as does the dance related to commoner Kamba and Princess Thoiba, who perform as pan-Indian Shiva and Parvati, in the legendary tragic love story of Kamba Thoiba found in the Manipuri epic Morang Parba. <inaudible> <inaudible> medieval period Historical texts of Manipur have not survived into the modern era, and reliable records trace to early 18th century. Theories about the antiquity of Manipuri rely on the oral tradition, archaeological discoveries and references about Manipur in Asian manuscripts whose date can be better established. The text Baman Kunthak, which literally means, Brahmin migration, states Panikar, states that Vaishnavism practices were adopted by the king of Manipur in the 15th century CE, arriving from Shan kingdom of Pong. Further waves of Buddhists and Hindus arrived from Assam and Bengal, after mid-16th century during Hindu-Muslim wars of Bengal Sultanate, and were welcomed in Manipur. In 1704, the king Charai Rangba adopted Vaishnavism, and declared it to be the state religion. In 1717, the king Garib Nawaz converted to Chaitanya-style devotional Vaishnavism, which emphasized singing, dancing and religious performance arts centered around Hindu god Krishna. In 1734, devotional dance drama centered around Hindu god Rama expanded Manipuri dance tradition. Maharaja Bhagyashandra of Manipur state adopted Gaudiya Vaishnavism Krishna-oriented, documented and codified the Manipuri dance style, launching the golden era of its development and refinement. He composed three of the five types of Ras Lilas, the Maha Ras, the Basanta Ras and the Kunja Ras, performed at the Sri Sri Govindaji temple in Imphal during his reign and also the Achuba Bangi Parang dance. 
He designed an elaborate costume known as kumal the cylindrical long mini mirror embellished stiff skirt costume, that makes the dancer appear to be floating. The Govinda Sangeet Lila Vilasa, an important text detailing the fundamentals of the dance, is also attributed to him. King Bhagyashandra is also credited with starting public performances of RAA's Lila and Manipuri dances in Hindu temples. Maharaja Gambar Singh R. 1825-1834 CE composed two parangs of the Tandava type, the Goshtha Bangi Parang and the Goshtha Vrindaban Parang. Maharaja Chandra Kirti Singh R. 1849-1886 CE, a gifted drummer, composed at least 64 pung columns drum dances and two parangs of the Lasya type, the Vrindaban Bangi Parang and Krumba Bangi Parang. The composition of the Nitya Ras is also attributed to these kings. <laughs> <laughs> British rule era In 1891, the British colonial government annexed Manipur into its empire, marking an end to its golden era of creative systematization and expansion of Manipuri dance. The Manipuri dance was thereafter ridiculed as immoral, ignorant and old-fashioned, like all other classical Hindu performance arts. The dance and artists survived only in temples, such as in Imphal's Govinji temple. The cultural discrimination was resisted and the dance revived by Indian independence movement activists and scholars. <inaudible> Modern era The Manipuri dance genre got a second life through the efforts of the Nobel laureate Rabindranath Tagore. In 1919, he was impressed after seeing a dance composition of Ghoshtha Lila in Silhet in present-day Bangladesh. He invited Guru Budimantra Singh who had trained in Manipuri dance, as faculty to the Indian Culture and Studies Centre named Shantani In 1926, Guru Nabha Kumar joined the faculty to teach the Ras Lila. Other celebrated gurus, Senurik Singh Rajkumar, Naleshwar Mukherjee and Adamba Singh were also invited to teach there and assisted Tagore with the choreography of several of his dance dramas. Repertoire. <inaudible> <inaudible> The traditional Manipuri dance style embodies delicate, lyrical and graceful movements. The dance features rounded soft sensuous movements of women, and occasional fast movements by male characters. Unlike other classical Indian dances with religious themes, the Manipuri dance artists do not wear anklet bells and the footwork is subdued and gentle in the Manipuri style. The stage movements is part of a composite movement of the whole body, chali or chari is the basic dance movement in Manipuri Ras dances. The repertoire and underlying play depends on the season. The dances are celebrated on full moon nights, three times in autumn August through November and once again in spring March or April. The Vasant Ras is timed with the Hindu festival of colors called Holi, while others are timed with post-harvest festivals of Diwali and others. The plays and songs recited during the dance performance center around the love and frolics between Radha and Krishna, in the presence of gopis named Lalita, Vishaka, Chitra, Champaklata, Tungavidya, Indurika, Rangadevi and Sadevi. There is a composition and dance sequence for each gopi, and the words have two layers of meanings, one literal and other spiritual. The longest piece of the play focuses on Radha and Krishna. The dancer playing Krishna expresses emotions, while the body language and hand gestures of the gopi display their feelings such as longing, dejection, or cheer. In other plays, the Manipuri dancers are more forceful, acrobatic, and their costumes adjust to the need of the dance. Dozens of boys synchronously dance the Gopa Ras, where they enact the chores of daily life such as feeding the cows. In Uddhata Akanba, states Ragini Devi, the dance is full of vigor, jumps, squats, spins, energy, and elegance. Topic. Costumes The classical Manipuri dance features unique costumes. The women characters are dressed like a Manipuri bride, in potloi costumes, of which the most notable is the kumal. A kumal is an elaborately decorated barrel-shaped long skirt stiffened at the bottom and close to the top. The decorations on the barrel include gold and silver embroidery, small pieces of mirrors, and border prints of lotus, quackle orchid, and other items in nature. The kumal may be an adaptation of fanic or fanic, a tighter sarong-like wear which is used in more vigorous dances and by male characters. 
The kumal is bordered at the top with undulating gauzy translucent top skirt shaped like an open flower, and tied in trikasta or three places around the waist front, back and one side with spiritual symbolism of the ancient Hindu texts. The upper body is dressed in a velvet blouse, the head covered in a white translucent veil, to symbolically mark elusiveness. The dancers do not wear bells on ankles as in other classical Indian dances, but like the Manipuri dance artists do adorn the face, neck, waist, hands and legs with round jewellery ornaments or flower garlands that flow with the dress symmetry. The symmetrical translucent dress, states Reginald Massey, makes the dancers appear to float on the stage, as if from another world. The male characters dress in a dhoti also called dotra or dora a brilliantly colored broadcloth pleated, wrapped and tied at waist and allowing complete freedom of movement for the legs. The Krishna character wears a peacock feather containing crown, with a feathery attachment at the back. The costume tradition of the Manipuri dance celebrates its more ancient artistic local traditions, fused with the spiritual ideas embedded in the love story of Radha Krishna found in the tenth book of the Bhagavata Purana. Topic. Music and instruments The musical accompaniment for Manipuri dance comes from a percussion instrument called the pung a barrel drum, a singer, small cartels cymbals, sembong, harmonium, a stringed instrument called the peña and wind instrument such as a flute, the drummers are male artistes and, after learning to play the pung, students train to dance with it while drumming. This dance is celebrated, states Massey, with the dancer wearing white turbans, white dhotis, a folded shawl over the left shoulder, and the drum strap worn over the right shoulder. It is known as Pung Column, and the dancer plays the drum and performs the dance jumps and other movements. Another dance called Cardal Column, is similar to Pung Column, but the dancers carry and dance to the rhythm created with cymbals. This is a group dance, where dancers form a circle, move in the same direction while making music and dancing to the rhythm. Women dance too as groups, such as in the Manipuri dance called Mandila Kalam, and these usually go with devotional songs and playing colorful tassel string tied cymbals where one side represents Krishna and the other Radha. Shaiva Tandava dances are choreographed as Duff Kalam and Dhol Kalam. The lyrics used in Manipuri are usually from the classical poetry of Jayadeva, Vidyapati, Chanditas, Govindadas, or Gyandas and may be in Sanskrit, Maithili, Bridge Bhasha, or others. Topic. Styles The traditional Manipuri Ras Lila is performed in three styles, Tal Rasik, Danda Rasik and Mandal Rasik. A Tal Rasik is accompanied with clapping, while Danda Rasik is performed by synchronous beat of two sticks but the dancers position it differently to create geometric patterns. The Mandal Rasik places the gopis in a circle, the Krishna character in the center, and then they dance in this mandala. The Manipuri dance is also categorized as either Tandav vigorous, usually go with Shiva, Shakti or Krishna as warrior savior themed plays or Lasya delicate, usually go with love stories of Radha and Krishna. <laughs> See also Rajkumar Singhajit Singh Darshana Javeri Manipuri Sankirtana References Bibliography Sariu Doshi Dances of Manipur, The Classical Tradition. Marg Publications. ISBN 978-81-85026-09-1. Manipuri by R. K. Singhajit Singh, Dances of India Series, Wisdom Tree, ISBN 81-86685-15-4. Devi, Pukrambam Lilabhati. Pedagogic Perspectives in Indian Classical Dance, The Manipuri and the Bharatanatyam. ISBN 978-9382395393. Ragini Devi Dance Dialects of India. Mudalal Banarsidas. ISBN 978-81-208-0674-0. Natalia Lidova, 2014. Natya Shastra. Oxford University Press. doi, 10.1093, obo, 9780195399318-0071. Natalia Lidova, 1994. Drama and Ritual of Early Hinduism. Mudalal Banarsidas. 
ISBN 978-81-208-1234-5. Williams, D. R. I. D. In the Shadow of Hollywood Orientalism, Authentic East Indian Dancing. PDF. Visual Anthropology. Routledge. 17 1, 69-98. Doi 10.1080/089494604902740013. Tarla Mehta, 1995. Sanskrit play production in ancient India. Mudalal Banarsidas. ISBN 9788120810570. Reginald Massey, 2004. India's dances: their history, technique, and repertoire. Abhinav Publications. ISBN 978-81-7017-434-9. Emmy Tay Nijinhus Indian Music, History and Structure. Brill Academic. ISBN 90-04-03978-3. Kapila Vatsyayan Bharata, The Natyasastra. Sahitya Akademi. ISBN 978-81-260-1220-6. Kapila Vatsyayan 1977. Classical Indian Dance in Literature and the Arts. Sangeet Natak Akademi. OCLC 233639306. Table of Contents Kapila Vatsyayan 1974. Indian Classical Dance. Sangeet Natak Akademi. OCLC 2238067. Kapila Vatsyayan 2008. Aesthetic Theories and Forms in Indian Tradition. Munshiram Manoharlal. ISBN 978-8187586357. OCLC 286469807. Kapila Vatsyayan. Dance in Indian Painting. Abhinav Publications. ISBN 978-81-7017-153-9. Wallace Dace The Concept of Rasa in Sanskrit Dramatic Theory. Educational Theatre Journal, 15 3, 249. doi, 10.2307, 3204783. JSTOR 3204783. Farley P. Richmond, Darius L. Swan, Philip B. Zarilli Indian Theatre, Traditions of Performance. Mutilal Banarsidas Publ. ISBN 978-81-208-0981-9. External links All about Manipuri dance, history and development of Manipuri dance forms, dance costumes, dance style, famous Manipuri artists, Manipuri Dance, RAA's Lila, video clip 1 minute 29 seconds. Official list of Sangeet Natak Akademi Award recipients in Manipuri.